Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Shante and you guys should totally subscribe and join my family. Today's video is a very exciting one. I've been waiting to do this for over a month. Basically, I'm gonna be showing you guys a clothing haul with some stuff that I've collected. So I'm showing you two pairs of shoes as well. And I'm also gonna be showing you guys some new beauty products that I picked up. Um, yeah, it's kind of just a big haul showing you guys everything that I've gotten. So excited. If you guys wanna see what I got, just keep watching. We're just gonna get into it. Right. So the first thing that I got, um, the stores that I shopped at were Romley, Misguided, and Nasty Gal. I've never shopped at any of those stores, so doing this was taking a risk for sure. But honestly, I really like everything that I got, and they were so inexpensive. Um, all together, I probably spent a little over, probably like almost 150, and then with the shoes, it'd be like a little over 100. But yeah, so we're just gonna get into it. Um, I don't really have them organized in any specific order. So yeah, um, first thing I'm gonna be showing you guys this shirt. It says "No Bad Days." Um, vibing or er, living on cloud nine. I got this from Romwe. It's just a graphic tee. Really wanted a lot of graphic tees, so those are gonna be in the haul. Yeah, I'm just gonna try to move along because I know I have a lot of stuff to show you. This, these following things are from Misguided. Um, like I said, I never tried out any of the, any of the stores, so this was taking a risk. Um, yeah, they, this and Nasty Gal was very, very inexpensive. Um, I only spent like $11 at Misguided, and I got three things. So one I got is this gray bralette. Um, it's very cute when I tried on it, it was so comfortable. It's supposed to be like a halter top. Kind of like a top, but I'm not going to wear this to the top. I'm more like under a shirt because that's doing a little too much. But this is very cute. I really like it. So comfortable. And the material is just very nice. Next, I got, um, they're two of the same thing. Just little tube tops because I don't own any. And I just wanted, even if I don't wear them as a top, I could always wear it under a shirt. So I got it in black. And then I got it in white. Just simple um, essentials to have in your closet. So yeah. Okay, so looks like I think we're gonna get Nasty Gal out of the way. Okay, so I only got two things from there. The first thing that I got was this pair of shorts. Um, I'm not gonna lie, I don't really like the way these looked on me. I don't know if they were too boxy. I kind of feel like I was wearing basketball shorts, but they're very cute, they're flowy, and they're also see-through. So I'm probably gonna just wear this like going to the beach as like a cover-up, but the shorts are, they're comfortable. I just didn't like the way they looked on me. Um, very inexpensive. I think I found those on clearance. This, I do like the way it looks. Um, this, I got in an extra large. This was a, it says spill the oversized tee. It's in the color charcoal. Um, extra large, like I said, so I got an over, it is an oversized tee, and then I got it even bigger, so I could wear a t-shirt dress. Okay, moving on. Everything is from Romwe. Um, if you guys never heard of it, it's an online store. Very inexpensive. I only spent $70 from there, and I got a lot of shirts and a pair of shorts, and a dress, and a romper. So, the first thing that I got was this shirt, like I said, obviously. Just wanted to get this one out the way. I really like it. Cute little graphic tee. Um, but this is the top that I got from there. This, I wanted to kind of expand my wardrobe and not wear as, like, bummier clothes. I wanted to get, like, dressier clothes and, like, summer clothes. So this would, like, wrap around your neck, and it looks like that. Very cute. A lot of these are kind of cropped, which I'm not sad about, but it's whatever. Um, I love the color mustard, and I don't know. I feel like I would wear this on, like, a date night with my boyfriend. It's very cute. And, yeah, this is one of the first tops that I picked out. The next top that I got was this. I got it in a large, so it wasn't as, like, tight. Um, I don't know. Sometimes I, like, size up, size down versus on, like, versus. Sometimes I size up or down, depending on the type of fit that I want. So I wanted this to be a little looser, not as tight. It's just like an olive green top with like the lettuce thingy on the side. I always wanted a top like this and I finally got one. So I'm very happy about it and it was very just doing this makes me think about how much of a mess I'm gonna have after this. Great. Okay, the next one, this is in medium. It's like a light yellow, kind of see-through. So I'll probably wear a bralette underneath this, but I really like it. Another lettuce rib top type thing, but it's more flowy and very loose. 
I really like this top. It is so cute and very comfortable. I tried all of these on. I was going to do a try on haul, but I don't know if you guys would like to see one. So let me know if you guys like try on versus regular type of hauls. So, so I know for like next time. Yeah. Um, next top that I got is another graphic tee. This says good things take time in a kind of dark green color. Very cute. Very comfortable. I love the material and it's like very soft and just not like a nice everyday tee. The next thing that I got is actually a dress. It's like that gingham. I don't know how to pronounce it, but if you know, you know, this reminds me of the Bath and Body Works perfume and I love that perfume. And I always wanted something with this like, um, design. So I got this in a dress. I'm not really a fan of the material. It just sounds kind of like thrown together in my opinion. Um, but the dress is cute. Everybody liked the way it looked on me. I haven't worn it yet, but I showed like my family and asked for their opinion. Um, so I got this dress and definitely different for my wardrobe. Like I said, I'm trying to expand it. Um, so yeah, we'll see where I wear that this summer. Um, I'm very curious because I haven't thought this through yet. Next thing is a romper. I actually had a lot of rompers in the past during like my middle school years. And then kind of just got taller and like grew out of them. So I never really got around to getting new ones. This one um, is like another mustard color with flowers on it. This fit really well and was very comfortable. It looks like that. Um, yeah, I don't really have any complaints here. It really, I really like the way it looked on me. It fit really well and yeah. The next thing that I got is actually a pajama set, but I feel like I could wear this shirt or even the shorts anywhere, to be honest. This is the pair of shorts. They're kind of like black checkered, very comfortable, a good amount of coverage. Obviously, you wear them to bed. Um, I really like the way the shorts looked on me, and this is the top that goes along with it. It says, it's nice to be nice. I really feel like I could wear this shirt anywhere. Um, very cute, very simple, and yeah. The set was very comfortable and I feel like I'm definitely going to get more clothes from there, especially the pajamas because it was like so comfortable and like the graphic tees, I will say so comfortable. All of the shirts were comfortable. The only thing that I didn't really feel like comfortable in was like the dress, but I'm still going to wear it. I spent money on it. The heck? <laughs> So, next thing that I got, I really love these. Um, I don't really like the way they looked, but I'm definitely wearing them still. They're like a mustard pair of shorts. I didn't realize how much mustard I got until I got this um, package. So, I got these in a the large so they weren't as tight on me. Because um, they're kind of like looser anyways. But they're really cute and this is one of the first pieces that I actually picked out when I was online shopping. And that was really fast. Um, my last top is also from Romwe. Like I said, most of the stuff was. This is a dressier top. This is like a light yellow and it's kind of loose up top and then like cinches at like your waist. Like makes it a little tighter, which I do like. And it looked really good on me. And it's just really cute. And yeah, I really can't wait to wear the clothes, guys. I'm so excited. I haven't went clothes shopping in I don't know how long. And it is just so nice to treat yourself. Feeling great. Now I'm gonna move on to the shoes and then the beauty products that I Okay, so the first pair of shoes I got, I'm sure you guys seen both of these before. I've worn them a couple of times, not too much though. It's an Adidas pair of sneakers. They look like this. They're so comfortable and I got them when I started working out. I actually got my mom the same pair in black for Mother's Day. She loves them. They are so comfortable. I can't put into words how much I love them. They're memory foam, I believe. Um, yeah, I got them in a size nine. They're running shoes, but I use them for working out and they're so comfortable, great quality. And I got them on sale. Each pair was originally 60. I got each pair for 30. So that was a steal. The next pair of shoes that I got, my mom actually purchased these for me. Thank you, mom. Um, she ordered all of us new shoes. I really wanted to wear these to school, but by the time they came in, school was closed. They are the Yacht Club Old School Vans, and they're so nice. I wanted these for the literal longest. Um, they're very comfortable, not too tight. I have another pair of like the regular black Vans, and they were kind of tight on me. I don't know why. Maybe I got the wrong size or something, but these fit so good. Like I said, they're really colorful. It's kind of a little loud, but I'm trying to change up my style and just figure out what I like, you know? And this actually goes along with a lot of things and I'm gonna be wearing it today. Just wearing a dark pair of jeans. 
I love these shoes. They're so nice, and I'm very glad that I got these. I've been wanting them for the longest. So yeah, that is it for the shoes, and now let's move on to the beauty products. Now, I didn't know if I wanted to include this in the haul, but I kind of did. I know not a lot of people traditionally do this, but this is my channel, and I'm going to just experiment and figure out what I like to do on it, you know? So the first thing that I got were these quenching coconut curls. I got the shampoo and conditioner. They were each $5.99, and I wanted to... This is what they look like. I forgot to show you guys. They look like that. I'm sure you've seen them at some point in your life. I've been trying to expand my hair's wardrobe too and just try out new products and stuff. These worked so well in my hair. I actually used it the same day that I got them, washed my hair and put a little bit of hair product just to see how my hair would react to the shampoo and conditioner. My hair looked so good. I got so many compliments on it. It was crazy. It was so crazy. So I'm definitely going to be using these more often. And yeah, it just has coconut oil, sweet honey, citrus oil, and it enhances natural softness, boosts decadent spirals, and tames the frizz, and I love it. It smells so good. It works so good, and I would definitely recommend. This isn't really a beauty product. I just forgot to show this. Um, I got these earrings from Rongwei just to spice it up. I don't really wear like crazy earrings. They look like that. Something different. I don't really have dangly earrings, and I don't know. I just really wanted them. I thought they were cute. Next thing that I got is Aquaphor. I got it in a two-pack. I've always wanted to try this as well. I see so many YouTubers trying it, and I wanted to try it too. And I got it when I ordered my bed set. As you guys may know, I'm getting a new bed, and I'm very excited. But I got this in the same order, and it came very fast. It just looks like that. If you want to see what the packaging looks like. Nothing crazy, and here's the inside. I hope that focused um so yeah that's that i love this chapstick and i'm definitely going to get more thank goodness i got it in a two pack i'm very happy about okay. it and the next thing that i got is just some more witch hazel as you guys know i swear by dickinson's witch hazel nothing crazy i don't really have too much to say about it i would definitely recommend um if i had to pick any skincare product it would be this specific witch hazel it's helped me in so many ways it cleared my acne scars I love this witch hazel. If you guys haven't tried it, you need to get it. Enough said. The next thing that I got is also some something that I rave about all the time. It's my Cantu. I use it in my hair. I always get the big container because my mom tells me to and it lasts a while. My last bottle lasted from before quarantine to a couple days ago. So it lasts a long time. Um, I love it a lot. It works really good in my hair. And it was pretty compatible with the shampoo and conditioner. If you guys have any other hair product suggestions, be sure to let me know. Like I said, I'm trying to figure out what I like, figure out what works good. And yeah. So guys, this is the last product that I'm going to be showing you today. I said that really weird. Um, it's a Cetaphil moisturizing cream for very dry, sensitive skin. As you guys know, I had like the moisturizing lotion when I first started using Cetaphil this is what I used it came in a tub and it's like a thicker cream which I kind of like it's a thicker consistency I don't know if you could see it um so yeah it's like a thicker consistency and it's mainly for your body but you could use this on your face too my friend recommended me to use this and I never turned back um I'm sorry guys I feel like there's so much noise outside but this is the first moisturizer that I used, and when I ran out, I couldn't find it anywhere. Luckily, I got some of this again, and I love it. It works really well. Um, if you have dry or sensitive skin, it works really well, and I would definitely recommend. Guys, believe it or not, we've come to the end of this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I realized that I didn't have a lot of hauls on my channel unless it was like back to school season, which is kind of dumb. Um, if you guys want more hauls in the future, be sure to let me know. I'll definitely do more and hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. It helps me out a lot. And, uh, yeah, I love you guys and I'll see you next time. Bye!